So I'm just going to show you how to edit a WordPress banner. There's one which I've already done. So just delete that. Yeah, and I'll just show you how I did that. So the first step is to actually select the middle content. So I'll just click use this and you can see the magic wand tool is enabled to basically select the middle of the middle of the document as you can see here. Right, so the first step here now is to add a background colour to that. So I'll just click on background and then I'll just change this colour. It just doesn't really matter what it is for the time being. And I can just change this firstly, as like I've said before, is to add a new layer first. And then you're able to play around with this. So the first step here now is to change the blending options. So the first step which I'll do is I'll add a gradient overlay. And to change this here, you've just got a dialogue which will be able to change any of these, and anything which you want, basically any colours which you want to change. You'll be able to do this simply by playing around here. So usually what I tend to find works best is when you, you go from one, use one particular colour um, and go from heavy to deep. So for this example, I'll use green. So I'll go from a heavy green colour. And I'll just add another one in here. So all I need to do is just click on this area here to add any more that I want to add in, so I'll just delete those and just add another one in the middle. So I just need to select that, select here, I can just move this up and then just go to the end here and select a light colour that blends in. Then all I need to do is just change this up this to there and then you can see below this create quite a nice quite a nice green effect so going with this green I think I'll put some trees on there so to do this I'll just need to go and create a new layer as you can see down here you've got the layers layer panes there layer layer panels there which will basically display the different layers um, I haven't renamed them just for the purpose of this exercise um, so the next step here will be to start drawing. So the first thing I need to do is find something appropriate, find an appropriate graphic to draw with. So I just need to find some trees. Just bear with me one second. There's one problem with having too many. So I'll just add a tree in there. Right, now I'll just change the colour after I'm done. So as you can see there, you've got the tree effect in the back. I'll change this colour again, just clicking on the FX, blending options, colour overlay. So I'll just move this over so you can so you can see what's going on in this point. So as you can see, it's got a colour overlay of red for the time being. So I can change this if I want. So I'll just move this up here. So I've changed this to a browny colour. Uh, that'll do. I see you've got your main banner there. And now I can just change this text to anything that I wish. So the first, so I'll just click in here and then choose, I'll just write for the time being first. And I'll just highlight that text and choose a suitable font. So for this example, just try and choose something that goes with. Tr try to something that goes with him. I'll just choose uh, this text as an example. I'll try and find another colour that goes quite well with, with this example. This is a green, maybe something red to go and stand out a bit. I'll just increase this font size. And there you go, that's basically one way of creating your document. So what you do here is you just click save as, go to your save it into a into a place where you're gonna be where you're gonna be able to find it. Then you need to go into your FTP client and then you'll be able to upload it into the same location as where the file is at the moment and then that'll change your document in WordPress. Thank you.